tomorrow. Well, all for these numbskulls. Okay. Kerry Washington. Now, she had I a big interview with um, Robin. Robin Robbins. Yeah, Kerry Washington. <coughs> from Good Morning America. She, she did a full interview with him. She recalls the shocking moment she learned her dad is not her biological dad. How was she? She just found out. Oh, she's Like a few years she's ago. She's old then. She's yeah, grown. Grown. And already a famous actress. You know how she found out? I'm not going to read the story. I'll just tell you. They were... Oh, I'm not that old. Bring that back, Johan. They were going to um, the Ancestry type of shows. Yeah. Was going to do a DNA thing on her. You know how they do it on celebrities? I told you a lot of people are doing it. Yeah. Well, you know how they do it on celebrities. Mm -hmm. They chose her. And she was excited about it to find out, you know, her lineage yeah, and stuff like that. The tribe, how much percentage of this? Well, and her that. parents got a hold of that information and got nervous. They contacted the ancestry people, ancestral, whatever, and told them, "We don't know how to say this. That's her dad, who she thinks is her dad, is not her biological dad." And if you do this story, it's going to all come out. We don't know what to do. So they they talked to some people. I even think they even talked to her people, I think. Her people that work for her. For her. And they say, you have to tell her. You have to. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I really feel bad. Because and they told her. I feel, for me, for some reason, I don't like that the fact that the parents held that from But her. let me tell you who her dad, who her, her father. Okay. He was a sperm donor. They don't know who he is. He's a sperm donor. She, her mom went to a sperm bank. Oh. So she doesn't have, there's, she, they don't know who he is. Did she go to a sperm bank because she didn't want to have a, a, she didn't want anybody to raise him with her? Or did she... Have some health problems. I don't know. Because <clears throat> this man she's showing that has her It's dad. in her book. It's in her book. I be Carrie Washington has a book coming out and she's going to talk all about it. I would like to know she what says, was her mom's reasoning for that. Doing She that. says she had a lot of insecurities and she went through a lot of stuff when she was younger. And she says now she thinks she attributes it to that. They were holding a secret from her. They were good parents, she said. But she felt something. And she said she always felt something. Was something. And that's what it was. They was keeping that from her. I'm thinking too as a sperm, a sperm donor. Can you still find out who they are? Well let me see what she says If she here. does the ancestry thing. She'll know what tree or that's whatever true. her father is coming it from. It says here. She said to her parent. Her parents asked her to come home to visit. Because they had something important to tell her. This came after she announced to her family her intentions to appear on Finding Your Roots. That was the show. A show that features celebrities learning about their family history through DNA testings. DNA does not lie. She says, and I went to them, my parents, and they told me that my dad is not my biological father. She said on the Today Show, that's what you said with Hoda and Jenna, that I was born from a sperm donor. She said the announcement had been shocking for her, but somehow on some level, she felt that she had always known. Mm -hmm. She knew something. something was it was shocking, but there was also something strangely familiar, she recalled. It was like it was confirmation when they said it to her. She said her revelation had been like a call to adventure for her. It felt like, well, this is a really exciting opportunity for me to learn more about who I am and who I want to be and also make sense of my life, she said. Washington added that writing her in writing her memoir, Thicker Than Water, which is out now, was healing for her. So there you go. It's, if, you, if there's an opportunity... Um, cause she, had, she don't go in detail on here, but she uh, probably in her book. Um, I was at that Tracy. Mm -hmm. She said Kurt Franklin was going is going through a similar situation, not knowing his biological fam, mom or dad. Oh or yeah, whatever. Traces of Taiwan says, "Oh wow, Kurt Franklin is going through the same situation." Yeah, we talked about that on the previous thing. We talked about Kurt Franklin um, finding out finding who his, his biological dad, his, dad his mother was. lied. 
and said that it was somebody else. He he didn't like this man because he was like, why you don't claim me thinking that this other man was the father? Exactly. His mother was lying. His mother's a piece of work. If you ever watched it, you can watch it because you always watch the stuff, uh, biographies and stuff. Um, and then um, she still didn't tell him. I told you he found out it was something. Somebody was in church or something. Y'all know if y'all watched it. Mm -hmm. And somebody was sitting next to him, the, his father, and was like, you look like Kirk Franklin or something along those lines. <laughs> or he looks like you. <laughs> and I think hey, the man had heard it before. Are you Kirk Franklin's dad? So then he asked him um, his mom's name. Do you know such and such? And the man Miller. Yeah. If you know what I mean. And the word knew like the Bible. He knew her. <laughs> so then they were like, you need to take a DNA test here, buddy. Because you know his mom. Uh -huh. And he looks like, like you. you. <laughs> yeah, that's connecting them. So then somebody went and told Kurt Franklin, this guy looks like you out here. <laughs> And he knows your mom. Ah, I mean, he knows, knows your mom. The biblical way. <laughs> so the man gets a hold of Kurt Franklin. He's like, I don't, I, it's up to you. I don't know anything oh, about this. I don't know nothing about knowing you. Wow, wow, if you want me to do a DNA test, I'll do it. And Kurt Franklin wrestled back and forth with it. And he yeah. decided, but what's the heck? Go ahead. If the man's not, he's not. Yeah. The man takes a DNA test and Kurt Franklin finds out you're 99.9% .9 his dad. Oh, if they had that on the What's His Name show, the mom would be like, ah, falling all on the floor. Are <laughs> oh, you talking about Maury? Maury. The guy be doing backflips. You are <laughs> the father. <laughs> Oh, my God. But can you imagine her? And she said, oh, Kerry Washington, they weren't going to tell her. If she wasn't going to do this show, see, that's a different I generation. It's a different generation. A no, no. That generation, I they don't, don't tell like nothing. I like that generation. They hide everything. And it's they don't want to look bad. I don't want anybody to know that I did this in my past. Right. I got to cover it up. Right. That is so misleading to the child, though. Yeah. I don't care how great of a dad that well, stepfather was. But even for... When we're doing DNA stuff now. But for, D, for medical. Medical reasons. Yeah. You could have an issue with your blood. Something. And that's not your real dad and your blood don't match or whatever. And come to find out... Oh, I'm sorry, uh, Carrie... Uh, he's not your real dad. You, I but you're right. Me. You can find out because remember, remember we talked. We had so much stuff we talked about on this show. I know. Remember we talked about them finding out that guy who exnaged somebody <laughs> from Ancestry.com. Oh, the man. DNA test. The DNA came up. The cops figured it was in that chain somewhere. It was in that tree. Yeah. His so family. they started knocking on doors. Of Around who, who could be uh, kind of Jimmy John Jr. and they knocked on no, the man's door. Man. Uh, Jimmy John Sr. Hold on, they knocked on his door. The man confessed, he just happens to confess. He confessed, he, he, he didn't have to, he didn't have to, but I said it was probably eating them. Oh, I they came and knocked on his door. Do you know this lady who was its name? <laughs> And he confessed. He confessed. He said, yeah, I took her. But they found I, out from DNA. Yeah. Nobody's in the system, but they could find the family DNA. and went and knocked on doors. DNA is serious. Yeah, that's why some that. people don't want to do the don't say name. That's why some people don't want to do the DNA thing because they don't want their DNA in the system. Yeah. No, no. Your no, family. Well, 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 well. No, you don't I, have to be in no, the system. That's what I'm saying. This story is going to say, even if you don't give your DNA, somebody a in your family, of yours that's it. or a sibling. Or I can build a whole tree off of one person's one DNA. One person's DNA. Yeah. yeah. The black people have had it hard. We came up through slavery. So a lot of them become embarrassed because they don't know this from that. No, white people um, do it too, Ma. But they do it too. The queen, look, know. we don't the know. People, Hold on, Ma. They've had a hard time. Ma, Harry, we don't even know if Harry belongs to the, uh, King Charles. 
So every and white people do it too. He looks just like Diana's boyfriend. <laughs> the guy she dated. <laughs> the guy has red hair and the same yeah. face. He should do a DNA. He's not. He won't show his royalty at all, huh? Wow. Queen Elizabeth is like, we're not touching that. But so white people too, Ma. But my point is that generation then just need to hurry up and die off. You know, Dang, like as far as I'm thinking, like Moses' generation, I'm yeah, sorry. Because okay. if you're hiding things like how Carrie is finding out, yeah. that's not good for the child. All right, well, I don't say and die we got, off. Well, but... eventually we're going to die off. All right, well, and the newer generation is going to take over. Um, Tracy said the dad attended a funeral of one of Kirk's relatives and stated he dated Kirk's mom when they were kids. That's it. Give it was us, a funeral. Give us another funeral. I know it was a years. service. It was some service and they were sitting there. Oh. And he said, oh yeah, I was with her. I knew her, you know. Okay. I guess sperm donors, they don't want to be known. No, that's why you do it privately. But you don't want to be even known. Even if you're privately doing it as a sperm donor, if you're doing that DNA, you're going to find him out, well, mm -hmm. right? Didn't you say they're going to find somebody in your lineage? Yeah. So she would have done this and went and found out that that man wasn't her dad. Yeah. And then she would have seen who her lineage is. Okay. All so. right, All right y'all. Um, I'm skipping over some stories. Let's go right to, um, let me show this. 